Well, hello and welcome to volume 131 of My Prostate is Trying to Kill Me. I'm Mark Graves, just a regular guy fighting prostate cancer, and I'm glad to have you along for the ride. I'm in my tundra right now, letting it warm up a little bit. Oh, how cute. Go riding by with her little doggy in the basket on her bike. And uh, it is Thursday, so a couple things I'm doing this morning. Got a bunch of stuff done in the garage, and um, got some mail sent out that needed to go. So right now I am heading over to my mom and dad's house and uh, picking up my dad's recycling. Us kids all save up our plastic bottles and stuff for my dad and then I think once a month or so um, we go over and drop them off or he comes by and picks them up depending and then uh, he sorts them out into these big huge bags and then I go back over and pick up the bags. Uh, he used to take the bags himself and drop them off and get his money back but um, my mom's kind of immobile and uh, with her knees and everything so um, he's let us start doing that for him. So once a month, go over there and get his bags, take them over to the uh, recycle, uh, where they give you the money. I forget exactly what those are called, but they had closed down at the beginning of COVID. They weren't doing them anymore. And so the bottles were really starting to stack up. So he had a ton um, a while back. Uh, I don't know bag wise what there is right now. I'm, but anyways, I'm on my way over to pick them up. And so I apologize, I'm driving while I'm doing this video. It, uh, it's a busy day, but I know I haven't talked to you guys since Monday. Uh, we've got uh, gorgeous weather. Um, I, I feel like crap, to tell you the truth. Um, I have not been sleeping well. I'm still not positive what's going on with that. I went to bed at, oh, you'll get a kick out of this. I went to bed at 9.30 last night. And my normal routine, you're gonna go? Okay, I'll let you go. Um, my normal routine, is that uh, I will go take all the medications and supplements that I have to take, and it's a handful. Uh, Xtandi alone is four huge, um, four huge pills that I have to take. They're like horse pills, they're big ones. So anyways, take those, and then I take uh, 20 drops of my, um, uh, sorry, this is how I've been all week. Just having trouble with recall and all that kind of stuff. But I take my uh, CBD oil, and I have two different kinds I want to take for during the day and uh, one I take for night. And so I take my one for night. You have to hold it under your tongue for 60 seconds uh, to help it absorb into your body. And then, uh, uh, you know, brush my teeth, put on my overnight bag, uh, urine bag and all that kind of stuff. And so I go to bed last night. Actually, probably was asleep after prayers and everything by about 10 o'clock. And then a little after midnight, I wake up and it was one of those, you know, eyes wide open, oh, holy moly's, I hope I make it. So I have to get up, get out of bed, grab my uh, urine bag and skedaddle down the hall. Uh, and I, <laughs> the term I've always used is I barely cleared cotton. Um, <laughs> it was, there was some uh, explosions going on if you catch my drift. And that lasted until Gosh, probably 2.30 in the morning. So I was in and out of there a couple times. Um, it just, you know, went went back and laid down in bed. And I was like, ooh, I don't feel secure. So I went back in there and, um, and anyways, about 2.30, maybe three o'clock fell asleep and then did the every half hour wake up, go back to sleep again thing. And then I woke up at uh, six and um, fell asleep till seven, slept hard. I mean, super deep. So when I woke up at seven, I was all groggy and everything. So um, something woke me up in the middle of my my uh, REM sleep. But at any rate, that's been going on all week. So uh, now I'm on my way over to my parents' house to pick up the recycling, take it over there. And then I had told him, hey, I'll treat you guys to lunch today. So let me know what you want. So I text my father earlier today. <laughs> hey, what Taco Bell? <laughs> I'm like, Alrighty then. So uh, I got their order and I'll be picking that up after I drop off the uh, or turn in the recycling and then I'll go over to uh, Taco Bell and pick up stuff. I, I believe I'll be ordering myself probably a cheese quesadilla with no um, no uh, sauce or anything in there. I think that's probably the only thing I can do. But uh, yeah, I thought you'd get a kick out of that. So. Um, just now turning into their place. Let's see. 
wait for this traffic to pass me. Okay. I just noticed that my, my restart screen was on for the phone. I hope that part actually was on there. I'll have to take a peek. So let me come in here and come through the parents live in a gated community. So I have to have uh, them scan my little thing. Good day. How are you? Doing all right. Woke up on the right side of the dirt, so I'm good. Go. Have a great day. Nice lady. She's been working in that guard shack for I don't know how long. Uh, all right, so uh, today's Thursday, so just a reminder, tomorrow will be uh, Free Shirt Friday. I don't know how many people I'm gonna get out of the cancer crew on there. I know uh, uh, Tom's been working his bootay off building fences. Uh, for his daughter and for some other people. And I believe Brian and his family are taking off today. Uh, they're gonna drive up north and visit some family. And um, I have not heard from one of the Steves this week. Uh, radio silence on him. So we will check on everybody and see how they're doing. Radio silence on, um, uh, oh, here I go again. Uh, Indio as well. So I will uh, check with the guys tonight and see what's going to happen with that But we'll have the video on tomorrow just to catch up and see how everybody's doing and then uh, do our uh, Free tea Friday so we can give away another t-shirt But I'm here driving I mean, it seems like I'm turning a lot stopping a lot My parents live in one of the world's largest uh, mobile home parks here in Huntington Harbor and uh just a beautiful place, absolutely beautiful place. I myself wouldn't mind living in here, except I gotta have a garage. I cannot function without a garage. And uh, so that, and this particular park does not allow garages. The one next to it um, does. Uh, much smaller park though, but they do allow uh, garages in there. So anyways, um, all right, blah, 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 blah. Let me uh, get ready to close this off and then uh, head over and get the, um, uh, now there's somebody in front of their house with a work truck. Okay, I gotta investigate this and see what's going on. All right, guys, thank you so much for all the, the prayers, the good thoughts, the aloha, the shaka, the positive vibes, the juju, everything you guys send my way. I totally appreciate it. And I'm really using it up this week because it has just been a crappy week. Just haven't felt that good. And um, so we will, we shall see, all right? But thanks very much for everything you guys are sending along and uh, I will see you on tomorrow's video. Okay, love you. Well, hello. Uh, this is the epilogue to uh, 131. So just to catch you up, um, went over, picked up my dad's uh, recycling, took that over and dropped it off. Got him $37.66. <laughs> he likes that. And doggone it if I didn't forget to take a picture. Four humongous bags. And when I say humongous, I mean humongous. Probably about four feet tall each, just this, literally, this big around, ginormous. So I got that taken care of, and then uh, they wanted Taco Bell, so I ordered on my phone, ran over there, donned my mask, which accounts for the beard, and uh, ran and got the food, ran over to uh, their house, and um, so we had a nice lunch, had a good conversation, took care of a few things for my dad. Uh, he, I had turned him on to a new kind of belt uh, they don't have holes in them. They're buckleless uh, belts, and they slide through. And I'd be more than happy to show you mine right now, but I'm not going to show you my gut. So, <laughs> they, but they work pretty cool. They don't have holes in them, so you don't have to get that thing where you're right in between sizes and you got to poke another hole in it. It's a ratchet system, and the the teeth are on the back, and they slide through, and you can hear it go, and it ratchets in. They're it. They're fantastic. If you're not wearing them, I guarantee you should. They're they're amazing. So, uh, but when you buy them, they're longer than what you need, so you have to measure them and cut them. And so I went over there, did that for him, took care of that, got them set up on uh, Venmo. Um, just had a wonderful conversation, just a great conversation, and uh, took the trash out for him, um, did a few other things, and then uh, took off from there. So I was there for a couple hours, and then had to go to CBS, pick up my prescription, pick up a few other sundries there. And I thought, you know, as long as I'm here, I might as well head over to, there's a Vons right there. And there's a couple of uh, things I needed. And I have not been in a grocery store for probably, wow, I'd say a good, 
well, gosh, before Thanksgiving, maybe back around Halloween, I have not set foot in a grocery store. Um, Cause I just, I either have my groceries delivered or I have them shop for me and I drive up there and they put them in the back. So I had to go into Vaughn's and uh, man, it was, I don't know if it was the time of day or what it was, but I almost had the place to myself. It was great running around, grabbing what I needed, toss some stuff in there, um, got, uh, got checked out, uh, got into the truck, headed on home, just finished putting my groceries away. Uh, got the trash cans out because it's Thursday night. And as I've said before, being retired, that's really the only day of the week I got to be sure of is Thursday night because that's put the trash can night out. So just to uh, bring you up to date, even though I had that difficulty last night, the Taco Bell seems to be okay. All I had granted was a, a steak quesadilla, so just tortilla cheese and, and uh, the steak. And I even asked them for no, no sauce on that. So looks like so far so good. All right. So anyways, that's wrapping up the day. I've got some stuff to do on the computer, edit this, upload it. And uh, I will definitely see you guys tomorrow for a free tea Friday. Uh, thanks so much for hanging out. I'll see you tomorrow. Bye.